Moses back in uh, down on a bit of private property this weekend. Got Anthony with me. We're uh, heading out to do a bit more exploring today. See if we can find a few other mines off the back of the back of the property. So, uh, yeah, we'll see what we find and uh, bring it back. Alrighty, gold hunters, we've pulled up. So, just down this ridge here, about maybe 200 meters. According to the map, there's a mine down there. It's about 200 meters long workings. Uh, antimony and gold. So, uh, we're gonna gear up, go for a hike, and uh, check it out, see what it looks like. Anyway, let's go. All right, got our first sign of workings. It's like a shaft here, it's filled up with water. And uh, just looking down the hill on this sort of line, we've got a few of them dotted down the hill, all the way down there. So we'll turn the machines on and have a wander around. Alrighty, so I've come down the hill a fair way, down towards the bottom end of the workings here. Um, no targets as yet, but as you can see, there's some trenches here uh, going all the way through here almost like water race trench running down the hill there another one running down there off the opposite side of this trench coming across here which looks to be an old filled in shaft by the looks of it so I think I've pretty much reached the end of the workings by the look of it, a couple hundred meters down. But, uh, you know, the. Anyway, I think I've got my first signal. I think. I haven't got any targets as yet. Alrighty, first target of the day. I'll give you a listen. Give a scream out. Alrighty, first one, first target. Let's get her out. Alrighty, gold hunters, we're on. You, first target of the day. First target of the day. And it's, uh, it's a little spicy. Um, you can't really see much at the moment, but I don't know if you can see the quartz there. There's looks like there's uh, a little bit of gold in the. I'm gonna focus in the top corner there, but uh, yeah, I'll have to give, give it a bit of a clean up to really see. Beautiful bit of mineralized quartz. But yeah, she's, she's a bit of a screamer. So I reckon there's a bit of gold in there. Uh, anyway, we'll take her back with us and uh, give her a crush later. Give her a wash. You. Alrighty, gold hunters, got enough signal. Sounds all right too. Just down in this, uh, I don't know if they dug this or what. It's like a little trench that comes out of this. Uh... Hello? There's he yelling out to me. Hopefully he's on. Anyway, let's uh, give you a listen. There's a faintest signal on top of the bark. And I thought, oh, I'll just kick the bark away and... Chirped up, sounds good. Let's get her out. Just a bit of rusty metal that time, unfortunately. Anyway, keep going. From those other set of mines, where uh, we've actually made it to the mines we're at last time when we we're here, where we did a massive hike up the hill. We actually found there's actually a road that comes right near it, and then we've just uh, scrub driven a little bit and then parked right at him. So, no walking up that bloody big hill. You 
But anyway, we're going to uh, have another scratch around today. Got a few hours and see if we can't pick up a few species again. Anyway, bring it back if we get anything. Alrighty, got first signal. Oh, she's muggy. It's overcast at least, but Jesus, muggy. Anyway, got a nice little chirpy one. Give me a listen. <coughs> Just on the back side of this mullet keep here. That's come out of this mullet keeps come out of this shaft here. That's uh well more of an adit. As you can see down there, there's a tunnel that goes through to the other side. If you look over there, that's the other side of the adit there. Where are we? Up there. And there's like a bit of a wall, but then there's a tunnel. Down under there, you can see the daylight through the other side and comes through. And this is the uh, the big spoil, spoil, molly cape, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, let's get your signal out and see what it is. Sounds alright. Just a little bit of rusty metal on that one, unfortunately. I'll keep going. Oh, how do you go, Unders? Turn this on. It's been hard slog. So much trash. Nails and nails and nails. So much trash. It's a lot of digging. But I didn't turn the camera on. I've got a spacey. <laughs> Finally, check this little guy out. Well, I get a focus. Look at that. Hang on, I'll get you get a better picture. Oop. Got my hand. That's got a bit of gold in it. Look at that. Nice, there's a bit of scrammer too. Like full blanking. <laughs> I'm thinking another nail, another nail, but no. It's got a bit of gold in it. Oh, focus. Yeah. You. Finally on the board. So I'm still digging each trash, nail after nail, <laughs> after I got that specie. But uh, I've got one here that sounds a little more chirpier. I'll give you a list, give you a listen. It's a bit more chirpier than a nail. Anyway, let's get her out and have a look. This is why you find yourself digging so many nails. When they're a little bit deep, they uh, actually sound pretty sweet, but She's a big old forged nail, big old square nail. That's why you gotta keep digging them. <laughs> 